Hi, this is Susan Laventero. Okay, so I think I'm just going to do a collective reading today. Let's see. But first, uh, I want to do all these sparks. Spark of grace, spark connection, and uh, spark of romance. Okay, so I feel like a lot of people are going to be trying new relationships. Okay, um, that's what I'm picking up. Okay, so uh, I feel like people are, are going to feel more adventurous this year and get out more okay so first i can't figure out if people want to be in the forest or out of the forest <laughs> so let's pick one of these fairy cards first okay so let's see walker on the wind the raven shows the way be courageous change what does that say Chains, change and chance can uh, bring exciting wonders. Okay, so I was picking this up yesterday, right? Um, if you feel like things are stagnant and not moving and you're kind of tired of the mundane, everyday grind, then that's a good time to uh, get creative, right? Because it's like... Okay, it's like this. Okay, when kids have something productive to do, like uh, be in the boys and girls club and play basketball and things like that, then they have something positive to put towards, right? It's like uh, a positive interaction with community. But if you're isolated and... Uh, it doesn't have to be negative, but it can go in that direction, right? And I feel like we're experiencing that in uh, the physical reality right now, right? Okay, but we want to release that. Okay, so um, creativity is a good way to get out of that kind of... Um, uh, because if you're in... Uh, creativity then that's movement and that's positivity usually okay so um and also with this raven right there's a story of the crow and um it was it's a pure crow but it got painted so that could also uh, mean that density can affect uh the human right and then you see them as a certain way and sometimes they practice things for so long it's hard to kind of uh it's like they don't look in the mirror right okay so um and then that's when the battles uh ensue sometimes in, in the physical reality okay so um the key is look for the golden nugget right in each experience because there is a wisdom in everything that's uh, trying to be expressed and um and there's exciting new wonders up ahead walker on the wind The wild god. Go to the woods. Ooh, yesterday. Who got the wild card yesterday? Somebody did. Okay. Go to the woods, to moss, to mine, to magic. Okay, so that came up in a reading. It's like nature is a great teacher, right? Okay, so uh, uh, being in nature is nice. Okay, and that could just be in your backyard. It doesn't have to be going out, you know, and roughing it. <laughs> Okay, all right. Okay, away we fly. Take the cloud roads. Delight in your imagination. And that's what it seems like the, all the readings lately has been like, get creative, get in your imagination. That's where you move the, the, the old story, right? And here it is in the card. Okay. Okay, uh, spiny sister, take pride in yourself. Okay, so, uh, okay, so, okay, so I'm getting several things with this. It's like, 
your spine is is pretty much how like the stream flows through the spine right so um, flexibility is very important in the physical body and yoga is a good way to kind of do that or tai chi or qigong uh, kind of movement right you can if you can't do those uh, i don't think it's about those uh, difficult asanas or stretches it's about moving the body and getting that circulation and moving that spirit energy through the body right okay also this is okay so it's like if you have those kind of uh, sharp thoughts right uh, that's what it could look like uh, from other people looking in right and um, also this pride can be dangerous right if you don't have a healthy self-esteem and a healthy ego uh, then that could be uh, blown up and puffed up right okay so and then that could be dangerous because you could cause suffering on other people if if you're not aware of your own energy right okay but um, so it's also about accept, accepting the nature of who uh, people's nature right it's like if moving from tolerance to neutral okay all right so let's get a spark of grace here identify the one thing you were most grateful for today okay appreciation okay that's nice okay spark connection Ooh, two came out okay be available when your loved ones need a listening ear oh my goodness yesterday it was all about elephant ear then the plant elephant ear came up and here's ear again okay be available when your loved one needs a listening ear. Okay. Consider how you could act as a mentor to someone else. Okay. I wanted one more. <laughs> Set up a clothing drive or a plant swap at your school or workplace. Ooh, that sounds like fun. I like that one. Okay. Let's do Spark of Romance. Since people are going to be trying new things. Let's see. <laughs> okay. So have a tickle fight. Okay. So that might be a message, right? Can we find softer ways to kind of, um, can we find softer ways to uh, communicate what it is we're trying to express, right? Can we bring humor to it? Can we be lighter about things? Let's get another one. Leave a note in the pocket or a bag of, uh, for your partner to discover. Ooh, I like that one. Surprise your partner with his or her favorite treats. <laughs> okay, one more. Or two more came out. Okay. Plan a weekend getaway just for the two of you, okay? Try exercising together. Ooh, I like that one because that, that kind of goes with the whole message. Okay. All right, now let's pick up one yoga card and then I'll close out. Okay, three came out. Okay. Okay. Intuition, tune into your intuition, how light. Okay, all right, and okay, so it's like getting out of your uh, not knowing, being self aware, and then here it is Kapal Bhati Pranayama, skull shining breath, and I think you could find this on YouTube. Okay. All right, and compassion. Ahimsa. And pranayama breath work. Okay. All right, thank you.